the chances. What's up, y'all? This is Rocket Rider 510, and I'm about to do a drone job again. And today, I'm gonna show you how to use Drone Link to create a map for a Zite view. You know I got it. Pull up, I come round, make my rounds, it's my town I, You know I got it, ayy When I'm round, they shh, now what's up, now this touchdown Ayy, like, niggas from city be hating, them niggas don't show me no love Ayy, it is what it is, cause I'm brushing my shoulders, walk off with a shrug Ayy, the shit is a dub, ayy, the shit is a dub, Ayy, why am I all in my feelings when I got these people that love me? All right, <clears throat> so your boy got another Zite View mapping mission. And uh, today I'm gonna show you guys how I create my maps using Drone Link. And the reason I'm showing you is because I forgot to set one up. <laughs> so I'm gonna go ahead and show you right here. Here's my Zite View. I'll go on the Zite View real quick, show you the mission. And uh, see, uh, I'll go ahead and check in right here. It says, it says 10 o'clock, but I'm late, which is obvious because I had to work today and I've started taking some of these jobs, even though they say 10 o'clock, they'll accept them being shot later. So here you see the building right here. Basically, this big yellow square is a uh, is where you have to do the map. And then the purple outline right there is a uh, that's the roof, the roof portion, roof inspection. All right. So what I'll do is I'll copy this address somehow see and he had his problem <laughs> this pin's annoying sometimes look at this so let me just use my hand the reason i use this pin is for when i create the map so i'll copy that go on the drone link right here and uh hit create so let me bring that up that's probably my last mission right there. They don't go straight to it. So I hit map, all right? And then I'll go in the search bar and paste this address. South B Street right there. Get this keyboard out of here. It's annoying too. So this is what I don't like is they don't really center up right there on that building. And you have to kind of pay attention to where you were. So I believe that's it right there. Yeah, see there's the little parking lot where I'm sitting in. And so there's that building. So what you can do if you're on a PC is to copy the KML, KML and this will transfer over. See, and I'll put that I'm taking off. I'm right about there. If I tap there, it'll show my takeoff point there, see? Let me go back here. This is what's annoying, like I say sometimes. So then you have to hit this little unlock edit thing right here and then drag these over here. So something like that and I'll zoom in right there and then kind of straighten it out a little more. Get some of the sidewalk in there. Oh, that's a bit much. You'll know when you check your grid and you can see about how much area you get. That might be actually good right there. Straighten that out a little bit. So then I need to go back in this map part and hit, see I don't change my altitude. That's usually about 145, right? for them. I didn't get to show you on that, but it's 80%. 80%. Then I need my pattern right here. And some people, people is asking, this is why I'm doing this, because those people asking, 
So this is why I'm doing this. It was people asking what software I use and see how I changed that to grid right there. See that change how that look? That's the reason I pay for the Elite, I believe, is because you can't necessarily get the grid. So I got my 145, 80%, and a lot of time I'll name this right here. I just go by the city. It's up to you. Sometimes I used to put the mission number, but I don't like doing that anymore. This is San Mateo. And uh, take off. Uh, this is what I do, this action on finish. I want none. I want it to just stop where I'm at. See, so let me change my grid right there. I just want my grid to be running kind of parallel. This was weird too, because I could put this thing straight and when it goes fly, I know this is kind of crooked. So, I'm gonna do something. Uh, it's annoying as you see. Something like that. Let me go back right there. So that's pre pretty much it for my map. So what I'll do is I'll go back and I'll compare with Zite View what they had. See as you guys see it, now let me rotate. But they basically just want the yellow outline of it. But I just go a little bit more, make sure I get enough images. And like I was saying, that purple is where my roof inspection will be. 445, which is showing. Which one's 445? I assume this building. See, it's where I get confusing too sometimes. But that's just to verify. So <clears throat> that's basically how I set up my map right there. <clears throat> and then once you're done, basically you just close this and it'll go back to the screen. And then when I'm ready to start, I'll just hit that San Mateo. So you come here, it sets it up. It's just not showing the camera and all that because, see, so you set it up. It's just not showing the camera because the drone's not connected and then you would just hit play and start. And as you see, it's showing you that'll take five minutes, 56 seconds. So if you want to edit, like if you made a mistake, you can edit and go back right there. Uh, I'm not going to change anything, but what I did want to show is if you hit this little clock right here, it'll tell you total time, 55, uh, five minutes, 56 seconds and 108 photos. And I got my max speed set to 10 miles an hour. So yeah, that's what I go through when I'm setting up my maps. And uh, this happens to me here once in a while where I'll forget, I'll accept the job, but then forget to set up the map. And then so I get out here and lose time because I have to do this. So now I'll go ahead and uh, throw this thing on my controller and uh, get this drone up in the air. set up got a little warning zone over here there's no big deal again already got my approval so hurry up and try to get this thing up here get this done uh oh so i can get up out of here <laughs> <Come on. laughs> fucking i'm gonna take <laughs>
2, 1, starting mission. So that's it for this one. Another job down, another dollar. Uh, just wanted to give you guys a quick look at how I use drone link for site view missions. Cause like I was saying, uh, a lot of people ask me what mapping uh, software that I use. And they ask, do I use a site view app? As far as I know, there's no site view app that you can use for mapping. I, I believe they have one that you can use for like photos and stuff like that. Maybe I'm wrong, but I just don't even play around with that. I downloaded drone link and uh, I paid the price for the Elite, which allows me to do the, the grid, as I was saying earlier. And that's pretty much what I use. It's kind of a standalone app. And then I take my photos just with the regular DJI app. That's it for this one, about to get up out of here. Uh, hope, hopefully I answer, answer some of you guys' questions or maybe I can refer links to this. So if you found me from either a search or uh, I answered your question, hit that subscribe button and the rest of my YouTube vocalizations, y'all hit thumb nuts. This is Rocket Rider 510 doing another drone job again. Now I catch you on the next one. I'm out. Burge. I'm alive.